okay children so let us start with the pointers okay page number 81 pointers question number 1 is answer the following questions who is the speaker in the poem so yes i know you know, you know the answer that is mother is the speaker in the poem next is whom is the poem being addressed to the poem is addressed to the child or you can say the baby yes okay next question what time is being described in the poem what time children yes it is night time is is described in the poem next question number d name the white and bright things mentioned in the poem which are the white and bright things children yes it is lilies and daisies are white and bright things mentioned in the poem yes children so these were the four questions come question number 2 that is guess the meaning of the following from the contest okay so you have to guess the meaning what is given the garden is still a light with lilies means the white lilies makes the garden appear to be bright and well lit up so this is the meaning next one uh, dawn wakes the starling so it is said that as soon as it is dawn dawn time the starling wakes up as the darkness disappears okay next is the meadow is wrapped in shadow the meadow that is the grassland which appears to be dark because of the shadow of the night falling on it so these are the meanings okay from the contest okay now next question is what is your favorite time of the day so children this is the personal response question so it may differ okay someone may like the morning time someone may like the evening time someone night or afternoon time so children whichever is your favorite time that you have to uh, write and you have to describe it in detail means you have to write the reason why you like this time if you are writing that uh, my favorite time of the day is evening so you this you have to write because the weather of that time is very pleasant evening time weather is pleasant and it is time of the sunset which looks very beautiful it is the only time when i get time for playing i have get time to meet my friends to chat with my friends okay that's why i love the evening time so what is whatever is your favorite time that you have to write personal response question yes you have to write it next is question number 4 you have to visit a library find and read stories and poems written by edith nisbet yes so this you can search in google yes okay so children on next page page number 82 there is question number 5 so here children you can see the word web so children what is the question draw word webs for the following okay begin with the given word and go on writing as many other words associated with it as you can okay so use this words to write other related words to form a word web so children first one is one is done for you okay like sleep from what are the words associated with sleep so as many words as you know that you can write so children the words associated with sleep is first is bed you need bed to sleep then night time sleep you get rest okay while you sleep then you start dreaming while you are sleeping children yes so these are the words you can add more also okay next is day which are the words associated with day that is uh, day time in sunlight okay it is bright morning then it is time to work okay time to play for children time to play then time to go to school yes so all these things you can write next is uh, bird so the things uh, words uh, associated with bird is that is birds means they fly they wing they are having wings the nest eggs then they are chirping then the colorful birds their color okay all these things next is meadow that is the grassland so the other words are green grass pleasant so in grassland you can walk it is a soothing soothing feeling okay next is garden so in garden uh, you can see the grass the people may go to uh, go for walking there then children may play there so garden means you can see the children there and also you can see the insects birds yes so all these things all these words are associated with the given words so in this way children you can form the word web okay so i will give you this answer this you have to 
uh, draw the pro proper word webs and write it properly and you can add your more words also if you can add more okay i will also give you some other words to form the word web okay that you have to try okay children understood the word webs yes okay now we will move to next question number 6 so children come to question number 6 that is it is an activity speak fast think faster okay so it is a kind of activity this you can do so what is given form groups of 4 to 6 discuss each of the following topics then each person in the group should choose a topic and speak about it for one minute try to say as many sentences as you can in that time so children here you can frame your own answer so here you can uh, call your friend and discuss and you can write your own frame your own sentence and write for any one of the given topic yes children so first one is what may happen what may happen uh, I may study a bird may fly into the classroom the principal may call me so these are the situations given so in the on the, uh, in these topics any one topic you take and you can frame your answer it may rain a dog may chase a cat a king may lose his kingdom a uh, friend may give me a storybook to read mother may make it least etc so children any one topic you take and you frame your sentences so children for example if i am taking mother may make idlis today so what um, what will i write for example mother may make idlis today as we are going to have all my friends at home for dinner okay my mom is very good cook can say my mom is very good cook she prepares very tasty tasty chutney spongy idlis and uh, tempting sambar too she has brought the ingredients all ingredients which are necessary to make the chutney that is coconut coriander etc etc so i have strong feeling that she may make at least tonight yes children so in this way any one topic you take and you write yes children okay so now we will move to question number next b1 what is not likely to happen first one was what may happen next is what is not likely to happen or will never happen so here some topics are given like it won't rain in the classroom i won't ever see a live dinosaur the sun will never set in the east etc etc anyone any one topic you take and you frame sentences for example uh, like i won't ever see a dinosaur i won't ever see a dinosaur even if i dream of seeing it this is a sad fact and a reality too because the dinosaurs have been clearly wiped away from the surface of the earth yes children they have vanished and not a single one is alive today as they couldn't have adapted themselves to the changing environment this environment it is changing now that's why they couldn't have adapted so it is very sad to accept that I won't ever see a live dinosaur. Yes, children. True. We will never see a live dinosaur. Okay. Because they have wiped out. Last one. C1. Imagine you are watching a scene. Imagine you are watching a scene. For example, someone learning to ride a bicycle or a cricket match. Give a running commentary on what you see. Yes. So, children. For example... Mm, it is given here now what is given here mono is sitting on the bicycle it has side wheels mono tries to push the pedal down no he stops his uncle holds the seat in one hand and the handle in the other hand he says come on mono etc etc so how you will frame like he says come on mono come on mono come on this comment in a children so you have to uh, have that feeling okay in that in your voice it should come so monu tries to uh, strike a balance but is tilting the cycle to one side and falls down he is slowly he is only slightly hurt because of his uncle's presence his uncle holds him while falling so he has only a few bruises once again he is trying hard to balance with a strong determination monu does manage to ride the bicycle without falling but oh only a short distance is covered and mono is back to 
square 1 that is the same position as earlier. Yes, children. So, in this way, you can frame your commentary. Okay. Understood? So, try. It is a good writing. Uh, it will be good writing practice. It, be, it is a kind of, uh, we can say, a uh, writing skill, we can say. This kind of activity. Okay. Speak fast. Think faster. Frame your own sentences. Take any one topic for uh, uh, or given that uh, any one topic and you frame your sentences. And I know that you can do it. Yes, children, you all are good. You, I can, I know that you can do this. Yes. So without fail, complete your pointers. Okay, in a neat way, everything right, write it properly, in a readable condition, so that you can also understand, read, and I can also understand whatever you have written, and it is easy for me to correct it. Yes, children, do the checking. So complete your work. So till next period. Next uh, lesson, next video we can say. I am taking your leave. Take care. Bye-bye. See you.